Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to completely configure these cheap RGB controllers that you can get from China for less than 10 euro. And these come with a controller. You're going to need one of these to be able to flash the device and they can be purchased. It's very easy to get open the device. Just look here. And we're going to need the transmit pin receive GPIO 0 plus 3.3 volts and ground. GPIO 0 will be needed to be ground, grounded before flashing. So here I'm just preparing the board with some flux to make it easier for the solder to adhere. And then it's just a case of adding a little bit of solder just to prep the pad before you do the soldering joint. Then just solder each wire in turn. So here I'm just doing the 3.3 volts and the ground. And you don't have to worry about uh, a really good job on these because you're going to be removing them after you've done the flash. So once I've done this, I'm grounding the GPIO zero by connecting it to the ground pin. And then just plug in the USB for the controller, load the ESP flash tool, and hopefully it should start to flash. Okay, the flash is complete. Now I'm going to actually connect using Termite and configure my Wi-Fi networks. You don't need to do this, but uh, it just makes it a lot easier. So I just open Termite and I paste my commands in to set my IP, uh, my SSID and password. Once this is done, I'll be able to access the device via the web interface now by typing the static IP address that I assigned using Termite. And there you go, I've got a basic TASMOTA module, but nothing will work as yet. So here I'm looking at a pre-configured device that I have got in my left cupboard to actually get the configuration. And you can see this is the configuration that you need to set up on the new device. So I'm just going to now replicate that on this other device. So the first thing I need to do is change the module to a generic module. And the device will reboot. And now I'm just going to replicate the different GPIOs. While, whilst I'm doing this, I'll just explain the IP receive and send is to configure the infrared module of the device. PWM 1, 2, 3 and 4 refers to the controller for PM, PMW 1 is red, 2 is green, and then blue for three and white for four. So red, green, blue. If once you boot up the device and start using it, if you find that the colors are not reacting correctly, for instance, if you're getting red instead of green, just alter the position of those PM one, two and three and that should sort out your problem because some devices are slightly different.
Another thing, if you're only doing a device that doesn't have white LEDs, you can just configure PWM 1, 2 and 3. But you can see now I've configured it, I'm getting controllers to control the different colours. So my next step now is I'm going to configure the infrared commands. So you can see I'm doing this through Termite. Uh, I'll include the commands uh, in the comments. So it's just a case of three sets of rules that are receiving that infrared signal and allocating the appropriate color or command. So there I've populated rules one, two, and three within Tasmota. And now I'm going to enable those rules. Where, so it's just a case of rule one equals, uh, rule one space one to enable, rule two space two, space one to enable that one, and rule three space one to enable rule three. Now the final step is to configure your module. So by giving it a nice friendly name. So here I'm just going to use uh, this particular strip light for some cupboards. So I'll call this one cupboard light. Now if you want Alexa or Google Home to detect it, just select Ubridge emulation and it will, you know, it will find it. So the final test is to show them in operation. So I've got these strip lights under here. And first we can check the voice. Alexa, lights on. Okay. Alexa, make light blue. Okay. Alexa, make light red. Okay. So there you can see that uh, the voice all works now because we program the infrared, we can also use here, so green, blue, okay, on off, and all of the other buttons work as well.